Lots of talk going around on the internet right now about genital weightlifting. Apparently there's been uh, quite a few views of some people who have been doing some interesting things with their private parts. And a lot of people have been hitting us up, you know, talking about, hey, this is like sexual qigong on steroids. And uh, you got to check this out. And um, it's, <laughs> it's funny, but it's not funny. And what I've noticed is that a lot of people who are talking about this and how great it is, these are the same people who've already damaged their genitals doing these, these tricks, these uh, freak show acts with their private parts. And they still defend the practice of genital weightlifting, which is bizarre to me. Now, I, I talk a bit about doing weightlifting in one of my videos. I do address that in the Amazing Woman Sexual Health series. Because, you know, I feel like these things are not necessary for you to have healthy private parts. And I tell you in the video, you know, you don't need this. You really don't need to put anything in or on your genitals in order for them to be strong. In fact, I tell you in the videos that you need to at least do the other ones for at least a hundred days before you even attempt to do anything like this because you can really hurt yourself. And a lot of people hear that you need these external devices in order to strengthen your pelvic floor and actually you don't. And it's best for you to start with what you have already and to get in touch with your body without anything external. Um, you know, it's cool to look at these people doing these things, but they're really damaging themselves. And what's really not cool is when those same muscles that you are trying to strengthen, those muscles become weak and you're back at square one. So you're trying to do something and you're doing something to the other extreme and then you're back to zero. What sense does that make? And you don't have to go through all of that. Listen, we've seen it all. We've probably tried it already. And what we put out there is what we believe in for your health. Not for show, not to impress anybody, not to be part of the circus, but for your health and your vitality. So, you know, this is joy and, you know, thank you for telling me about all of these videos. We've already seen them. But what we want you to do is to look at ours so you can start to keep your body parts in good health in your old age. Okay? That's what we really want for you to do. So, we'll talk again soon. Uh, yeah.